What makes Tesla Optimus Bot Gen 5 become a game changer? It's not just incremental upgrades. It's a symphony of biomechanical ingenuity, from dexterous hands that mimic human finesse to ankles engineered for fluid, human-like running. As of December 2025, with pilot production lines humming in Tesla's Fremont factory and mass scaling on the horizon for 2026, Optimus Gen 5 promises to propel humanity into an era where robots don't just assist, they elevate before we deep dive into this insane Robotech. Please help us reach 20,000 subscribers. It would be a huge motivation for us to keep bringing you amazing episodes about Tesla Optimus, humanoid robots, and all the latest AI and EV innovations from Elon Musk. To catch the revolutionary scope of Optimus Gen 5, one must first appreciate the robot's meteoric journey. Launched amid skepticism at Tesla's AI Day, the early iterations of Optimus were rudimentary, a bipedal frame capable of basic walking and object manipulation, but plagued by clunky movements and limited autonomy. Critics dismissed it as vaporware, a distraction from Tesla's core electric vehicle empire. Yet under Musk's relentless drive, the project accelerated. By mid-2024, Gen 2 demonstrated folding laundry and sorting objects with eerie precision, powered by Tesla's Dojo supercomputer and neural networks trained on vast fleets of real-world data. Fast forward to late 2025, and Gen 3 has already shattered expectations, with Gen 5 blueprints integrating even more advanced AI from XAI's Grok models. Musk envisions deploying 5,000 units by year's end, scaling to a million annually by 2027, at a price point around $20,000 per unit, cheaper than a mid-range sedan. This affordability isn't hype. It's engineered through Tesla's vertical integration, from custom actuators to energy-efficient batteries. Tesla Optimus Gen 5, Musk explains, will be the von Neumann probe of robotics, a self-replicating system that explores, builds, and sustains human endeavors across factories, homes, and beyond. At the heart of Gen 5's prowess lies its groundbreaking hand design, a feat of engineering that Musk has called exquisite. Early Optimus versions relied on rigid 11 degree of freedom grippers, adequate for simple tasks, but woefully inadequate for the nuanced dexterity required in real-world scenarios. Enter the V3 hand, now refined for Gen 5 with an astonishing 50 actuators, 25 per forearm and hand, eclipsing the 17 actuator prototype of just months ago. This isn't mere quantity, it's a leap in quality, incorporating tendon-driven fingers that flex with human-like compliance and sensitivity. Imagine a robot that doesn't just grasp a tool, but caresses a fragile egg or threads a needle during surgery. Tesla engineers, drawing from biomechanics and AI simulation, have embedded soft palm sensors and adaptive joints that learn from touch feedback in real time. In a recent NeurIPS 2025 demonstration in San Diego, an Optimus 5 2.5 unit showcased this evolution by juggling Rubik's cubes while solving them, a task blending precision, balance, and cognitive processing that left audiences stunned. Musk has been vocal about the hand's challenges, admitting in an October 2025 interview that it was the most difficult part of the robot. Initial prototypes faced scalability issues, with costs soaring to $30,000 to $80,000 per pair due to intricate wiring and materials. But Tesla's iterative approach, fueled by in-house manufacturing, has slashed that to under $10,000, with Gen 5 targeting sub-$5,000 through 3D printed composites and AI-optimized assembly. This hand isn't isolated. It's symbiotic with Optimus's neural architecture, allowing the robot to perform over 4,000 tasks autonomously, from cooking meals in 15 minutes to cleaning houses with minimal supervision. In a viral November clip, Musk quipped that the V3 hand is another level beyond its predecessor, capable of kung fu strikes that blend martial arts fluidity with surgical accuracy. For industries like healthcare, this means Optimus Gen 5 could assist in delicate procedures, reducing human error by 99% through its superhuman precision. Musk's bold claim that Optimus will outperform the finest surgeons gains credence here, as the hand's haptic feedback loops enable it to detect tissue variations imperceptible to the human eye. Yet no revolution comes without overcoming formidable hurdles, and Optimus's lower body innovations address one of the most persistent doubters, mobility. For years, skeptics argued that true humanoid running sustained, stable locomotion at human speeds, was a pipe dream for battery-constrained robots. Early Optimus models topped out at a plodding 2.5 miles per hour walk, 
vulnerable to uneven terrain and quick directional changes. Enter the Gen 5 ankle design, a marvel of flexible, compliant engineering that has silenced naysayers by enabling seamless 5 miles per hour sprints. This upgrade, unveiled in a December 2025 lab video, features articulated toes and multi-axis joints with variable stiffness actuators, allowing the ankle to absorb shocks like a natural foot while maintaining gyroscopic stability. Tesla's neural control system, trained on billions of simulated gait tokens from the company's vehicle fleet data, orchestrates whole body coordination, swinging arms for balance, adjusting hip torque mid-stride. The breakthrough is profound. In a side-by-side -side comparison with rival figure AI's 03 model, Optimus Gen 5 not only matches but exceeds in natural fluidity, clocking speeds up to 8.5 miles per hour in controlled tests while navigating obstacles. Musk highlighted this in a late November X post, noting how the design solves the compliance problem that has bedeviled humanoid robotics. Previously, rigid ankles led to falls on slight inclines. Now, with energy-efficient 2.3 kilowatt-hour batteries powering nearly full-day operations, Optimus can run errands, patrol warehouses, or even join search and rescue teams without fatigue. A Miami demo earlier this month, though marred by a teleoperator glitch causing a dramatic tumble, actually underscored the progress. The robot's recovery algorithms kicked in faster than in prior versions, preventing injury. Tesla clarified it as an edge case test of improved balance and gait, not a failure, but the incident reignited debates on autonomy. Regardless, the 5 miles per hour capability, once dismissed as unattainable, proves Optimus's readiness for dynamic environments, from bustling factories to elderly care homes where quick response times save lives. How powerful is the Tesla Optimus compared to other competitors? Before we begin, please help us reach 20,000 subscribers. It would be a huge motivation for us to keep bringing you amazing episodes about Tesla Optimus, humanoid robots, and all the latest AI and EV innovations from Elon Musk. Tesla first introduced Optimus during its AI Day event in August 2022. The initial prototype was little more than a person in a suit. Still, it captured global attention with Elon Musk's promise of a general-purpose humanoid robot that could perform unsafe, repetitive, or boring tasks. Over the next three years, Tesla invested heavily in hardware, software, and real-world testing. By mid-2024, Optimus Gen 2 had already shown impressive progress. Smoother walking, basic object manipulation, and integration with Tesla's neural network architecture originally developed for autonomous driving. However, it was Optimus Gen 3, unveiled in May 2024 and demonstrated publicly in November, that truly began to resemble a viable product. Optimus Gen 3 stands 5 feet 8 inches tall and weighs about 125 pounds, with a sleek, lightweight frame made from carbon fiber and aluminum. Its design prioritizes balance, durability, and energy efficiency. In factory trials conducted throughout 2025, Gen 3 was deployed in Tesla's battery production lines to sort cells, move parts, and assist in assembly. It walks at up to 5 miles per hour using a natural heel-to-toe gait, a significant improvement over the stiff, robotic steps of earlier versions. Powered by a 2.3 kilowatt-hour battery, based on Tesla's 4680 cells. Gen 3 can operate for up to 8 hours on moderate tasks. The robot relies on a sophisticated sensor suite, high-resolution cameras for vision, force torque sensors in the fingers for touch feedback, and inertial measurement units to maintain balance. All of this data feeds into Tesla's full self-driving neural networks, now adapted for robotic control. This allows Generation 3 to navigate complex environments, avoid obstacles, and learn from experience through over-the-air software updates. In controlled tests, it achieved 95% accuracy in repetitive tasks. However, real-world performance revealed limitations. In Tesla's factories, Gen 3 operated at less than half the speed of a skilled human worker. Joint overheating, software delays, during multitasking, and occasional loss of balance on uneven surfaces prompted a rapid redesign. Despite these challenges, the data collected from thousands of hours of operation proved invaluable for the next iteration. The transition to Optimus Gen 4 began in earnest in early 2025 and was officially announced in September of that year. Rather than a complete rebuild, Gen 4 is an evolution, refined, faster, and smarter. 
The most significant upgrade is the integration of XAI's Grok 3 large language model, which gives the robot advanced natural language understanding and conversational ability. For the first time, Optimus can respond to vague or contextual commands like clean up the kitchen or help me carry these boxes with appropriate actions. This marks a shift from purely task-based programming to intuitive, human-like interaction. Hardware improvements are equally impressive. Optimus Gen 4 retains the 22 degree of freedom hands but increases torque output by 20%, allowing it to lift up to 45 pounds, more than double the capacity of many competitors. Walking speed rises to 6.5 miles per hour, and new balance algorithms enable stair climbing and recovery from pushes or slips. The battery system is optimized for efficiency, extending runtime to 10 hours. Perhaps most importantly, Genesis 4 introduces adaptive learning. The robot can observe a human performing a new task once or twice and then replicate it with minimal programming. In demonstrations, it has folded laundry with deliberate creases, sorted recycling by material, and even played simple games with children. Production of Gen 4 reflects Tesla's manufacturing expertise. Assembly takes place on dedicated lines at Gigafactory, Texas, using modular components and automated processes borrowed from vehicle production. Core parts like the Neural Processing Unit, a custom chip derived from Tesla's Dojo supercomputer, are standardized across units, reducing complexity and cost. What do you think about this? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. We hope to bring the best information to you. Please give a thumbs up if you like this. Join Techno Creator by subscribing and hit the bell icon so you will not miss out on any awesome videos. We value your feedback. Thanks for watching. Until then, stay safe and have fun.